Hi everyone. <clears throat> Today I'm just doing a quick video. Someone actually um, was asking me about their peas on the weekend, and um, it occurred to me that it might be a might you know well be a common issue. I've had a couple of people ask me, so it's just a quick video in regards to harvesting peas. Now, peas are pretty easy. You'll find that you'll get snow peas, and then you'll get your regular peas like as in um, like you know mashing peas and stuff like that so the best thing to do even though a lot of them will look fairly thick or you know like plump they actually won't be so what you got to do just give them a quick feel like so if there's no give in there like this one you can see there's a bit of give if there's no give in the pod then they're ready to harvest now what you can do Obviously, once you pick them, twist off the top, that'll come away, then the whole pod will just open up like that. And there's your peas inside. I dropped one, but don't worry about it. Dropped two. <laughs> Alright, so they're a good size. So when you actually grab the pod, just give it a squeeze. And if there's no give in it, that means, well, obviously the peas are filling up the inside of the pod, so they're a good size. And then once you've got your peas like this, if you want to keep them, they're great to eat fresh, of course. If you want to keep them, just blanch them in some hot water. So just literally have some boiling water going, plunge your peas in, let them boil for about, oh, people say different times. For Personally, I'll put them in for about a minute and a half, right? Take them out, put them into some cold water, right? If, put some ice cubes in the water too if you can now that stops the cooking process okay so they're not continuing to cook and just become um, like a mushy not that there's anything wrong with mushy peas <laughs> that's a different video altogether so take them out of the hot water put them into cold let them go completely cold in that drain off the water right so make sure that they're not just wet all right, completely wet because that water will obviously become ice and when you freeze them that ice will affect the peas themselves so take them out drain them off well put them into individual bags if you're going to eat them individually like if say there's two of you then just put like two person servings per bag otherwise you're going to defrost some you probably won't eat what else you've got left over and they'll go to waste and then pop them in your freezer and they'll keep for ages all right so that's had a harvest your peas. So let me just do another real quick one. So these aren't too bad. There's a good one. This one's pretty good. I don't know if you can see it off camera. Again, I know this is um, might seem basic to a lot of people, but a lot of people haven't harvested their own peas before. So just twist it off the top, right to there. You'll get that string out, which makes it, if you're going to, same with snow peas, you get rid of that stringy bit. And then just pull open the pod and you get your peas which are quite nice now my pea pods I just throw them back onto the bed and that's it how to harvest peas easy peasy thanks for watching sorry I got a mouthful of peas I'll see you again soon bye